Hello, so it's Rihanna from the future, just popping in before you see the rest of this Dubrovnik Bosnia video to say it's a lot of B-roll. It is, um, it was a week that we spent there and we were there with our friend Jesse and we spent a lot of the time just chilling out, relaxing and recuperating. So we had a lovely week, um, ate a lot of delicious food, enjoyed a lot of drinks, went out to the islands a couple of times and went for a day trip to Bosnia, which you'll see obviously in this video. But there's a lot of B-roll. I didn't pick the camera up a lot because we were just chilling out and having a lovely, lovely time. But if you do get to go to Dubrovnik, I highly recommend. Really affordable and such a beautiful, beautiful place. The people are beautiful. The Just the city is just stunning. The old city, we stayed in the old, old town, old city, um, inside the city walls. And it was totally worth it. It was stunning. So just thought I'd pop in and say that beforehand. Also, this video, I'm obviously coming to you from the future. Um, but all of these videos that I have been editing and uploading, I hope you've been enjoying. I've been enjoying doing it and reliving it because this trip did happen towards the end of last year. And I filmed everything but didn't start editing any of it. So I'm now, while I have time, editing and uploading. So I hope you're enjoying. I know it's a little bit out of whack uh, for the seasons and whatnot. But I'm doing it more for my memories than for anything else. But if you guys get some joy out of it, that's awesome too. Um, or it might inspire you to go. Um, but yeah, that's just me popping in to have that quick little note before the video goes on because there's a lot less talking in this video and a lot more just visual prettiness um, of the beautiful scenery. So hope you enjoy and yeah, we'll see you next week. exploring for the day waiting for Jesse to get here um, but already it's so pretty like the water is so clear and blue um, like I don't know if you can see you can sort of see all the rocks already and it's probably maybe like two three meters deep easily there and you can still see it clear as anything um, but yeah it's so pretty just were walking we we thought we'll come down get Caitlin some Panadol she's got a bit of a headache um, 
But um, as we were walking to get Panadol, we walked around the corner and Jessie had just gotten off her flight. So we had, and, she, and she had Panadol. So get double get down. That's it. So we helped her. <laughs> so we helped her carry stuff up. Well, Caitlin did. I walked up. I helped at the end. Lots of steps. She's at the top of at the top top. So that'll be fun this evening when you're getting back. Um, but we're just having some dinner and just enjoying the evening. And it's cooled down now, which is nice. It was very very warm today. That's where we're at. sweating. <laughs> we're in Dubrovnik. Jessie's here. And then we're just waiting for Caitlin. She's going to put her bathers on because um, they're going to go for a swim. I'm just going to put my legs in. I don't want to get my hair wet. <laughs> That's me being me. Um, but I'm going to put my feet in to cool down because the water is so clear. Um, and we're on this little rock. There was like a jetty like a jetty a pier that we were sitting on yesterday over here and then you come up these little steps on the side um, and you come around the corner and there's this whole rocky area um, and it's kind of like beachy rock in that there's five bits of rock that have been like concreted over so you can sort of lay your towels down and stuff um, and then there's a lot of little ladders into the ocean so you can go for a swim which is oh I just burped excuse me <laughs> I just had water. <laughs> oh, anyway, sorry for that. Um, but yeah, it's lovely. We're looking at the little island over here, which is the one that has wild peacocks and rabbits on it, apparently. So we might go out there. Um, we're just trying to figure out what we do for the next few days. Um, we've booked some more accommodation, so we're all going to be staying together, which will be nice. Um, yeah, just up the road from where we're staying at the moment. So I think it's on the same street. Which is no a win. Stairs. Yeah. <laughs> the the ad said no stairs, which is a win because we all don't want to be carrying cases up and down. Poor Jessie's gonna have to carry it. Oh, no. There's a cat right in the nook there. They make my nose so itchy. Like already I took a hay fever tablet yesterday afternoon just walking around the town, my nose was itchy. No. Anyway, there's a there's a cat. Sunset, and this place does fresh juices and beer and water, and like everyone's just sitting along here, watching the sunset. And um, yeah, it's very lovely.
<laughs> been a little while. Um, it's been a few days. The last time I vlogged was on the wall, having our cocktails on the wall. It's been a few days. We've just been chilling out in Dubrovnik. Um, we went out on a boat and went to like a blue cave, some green or tr three caves and then a beach. Um, so the girls jumped off and swam. I just stayed on the boat. And then um, yesterday it was a rainy day, so we just sort of had a chill out, catch up kind of day on sleep and just just chilled for a bit. We went and had a massage, but both Caitlin and I had a massage. Jesse just chilled out. Um, Caitlin's very sore today. I've got a little bit, a little bit sore, um, but it was a really good massage. Thai massage in Dubrovnik at like this day spa at the Hotel Starry Grad. Um, highly recommend. It was very, very lovely if you're wanting a massage somewhere. Um, and because it was raining, we just sort of stayed inside all day. Today is supposed to be raining, but it's actually really nice outside. And we're currently in Bosnia, Herzegovina. Um, so we're doing a day trip from Dubrovnik out to Mostar um, and also to Kurt, starts with K. Kravitz, Kravitzka Lakes or Kravitzka Waterfalls. I'm probably saying it wrong, but um, I've, I say a lot of things wrong. Um, but yeah, we're heading out out there for the day, doing a day trip, and then coming back um, to Dubrovnik. And then tomorrow morning we head off on a bus to Split. Um, then we'll head up to Split. We have a day out on one of the islands. Then heading towards Plivitz Lakes. We're gonna figure out how we get there. Um, and then up to Zagreb and then into Slovenia. So yeah, it's been a good couple of days, just chilling out. We're currently on a tea break. Um, so I've gotten a tea because uh, it was just a very chaotic coffee station. I'm like, yeah, black tea will do. Um, but yeah, it's sort of a different system in that you have to sort of pay at the counter, then you take the receipt up to the to the yeah, people that are making the coffee and then they'll make it and then they'll give it to you kind of thing. So yeah, but it's really lovely. It's a lovely view outside. <laughs> and we're just chilling out. something to go out to one of the islands tomorrow um, but it's been a good week in Dubrovnik and we've explored yesterday was really lovely and really fun um, I took some videos of that I didn't really vlog much of that either <laughs> been really bad this last week but hopefully I can pick it up again um, but yeah no it was good yesterday was very interesting to learn all about the history of the place um, they've had a hard run but, um, yeah, that was good. 